Chef Mr. West and welcome back to the cooking channel. Yes, my viewers and subscribers. Some get ready here now to make some steamed fish head. This is kingfish of course. Here it is, I just put some um, lemon juice in it. And I'm going to be seasoning it up right here. Put in the seasoning and everything right in the, the frying pan here. That's what I'm I'm gonna um, do, doing it in. Look at that. So now it's all um, clean, washed, and everything. So now I'm gonna put the um, the seasoning. So stay tuned. That's my viewers and subscribers. So the onion. Putting that on now. Already washed already and everything. Putting on that natural seasoning. Okay, so we're making some steamed fish head. That's the red, the yellow onion there. Put a little piece of red onion. some green bell pepper green bell pepper Stay tuned, we'll let you see the progress as we go along. So now we're going to put some of our dry seasoning. Right here we have some red cayenne, ground cayenne red pepper. Sprinkle some of that over there. Spice it up a little bit. It's the ground cayenne red pepper there. We have some thyme, thyme leaves. Not too much, a quarter teaspoon thyme leaves. All that dry seasoning, you know, let this thing, you know, be nice. We have some paprika there. Steam fish here is going to be wicked. The steam fish head, that's the paprika there. Then, of course, we have some basil. Put for um, a little of that wet Jamaican jerk seasoning right there for the flavor, Give it, gives it a nice flavor there. Right over here, we have some all purpose seasoning, the Maggie all purpose. There it is. We're using the Maggie All Purpose Seasoning. Sprinkle that all over that. Look at that. This is what I'm talking about. You have some, you have a little season to the bone right here. Sprinkle some of that right in that. Season to the bone. So just stay tuned my viewers and subscribers and remember to like, share, subscribe and leave your comments below. we we'll catch you on the other side. Yes my viewers and subscribers. So this is what is going down now. Fish is there bubbling. Steam fish head. I know some of you are probably saying fish head. Yeah. King fish head is one of the best fish head. You got to try it out. Here I'm putting some... Um,
cutting up some more some seasoning here. Some celery. So what that is. They almost slip me there. Put a pinch of butter. Put a little butter there. Butter is always good in steam fish. Then of course we're gonna put some some oil. Not too much, a little bit. tomato so I'm going to use some tomato ketchup look at that that's ketchup there put some on that down to that thick gravy with all that natural seasoning the celery red onion yellow onion and all that dry seasoning there too we have also some some um, green bell pepper all-purpose seasoning seasoned to the bone thyme leaves put some basil in there look at that is what I'm talking about. So stay tuned, my viewers and subscribers, so we we'll let you continue to see the progress as we go along. Always remember to like, share, subscribe, and leave your comments below. We'll catch you on the other side. Yes, my viewers and subscribers, so now I, I the change of plan, I decide to, to steam down some some potato in the fish. So I, as you notice, I, I peel the potato and cut them thin cut. Thin slice, so it'll be easier to cook. You know, so I just show you. So I'm gonna put that in and let that cook down into the fish. Call the steamed fish with potato. Look at that. I'm gonna cover it with that lid and let it just stay there and cook down. You see the reason for cutting the potato thin slice is so that it will cook easily, you know. Not by the time the fish done steam properly, the potato will cook. You just put it not too high fire, just medium. And let it just stay there and steam down. I was going to do some rice with it. My wife said that, oh, you could put some potato in there. So I said, I knew she wanted some. So I said, okay, let me do the potato. There it is. Look at that. Looking so nice. Let that stay there and just steam down nicely. Go down to that thick gravy. Then we all done. Look at that. Isn't that lovely? Steam fish egg. And by the way, like I said, if you've never tried a fish head before, kingfish head is one of the best kingfish head. Soft bone. Very easy to eat. Very delicious also.
So we will catch you on the other side. Stay tuned. Yes, my viewers and subscribers, so welcome back. So as you can see, everything is just coming down nicely. Just turn the um the heat down a little bit, the fire. So it's just steaming down nicely. The potato, as you can see, it's all tender, almost done. You want it to do quick like this, you can cut them thick. You just have to do it thin, so everything will just soak in. Look at that, the fish head there. So I'm just going to put the lid back on and let it sit there for maybe about 10 more minutes because I want everything to be tender and nice. And the fish is good, so I... I wanted to put some okras in there, but I guess it's too late now, so we'll leave that for um, some other time. So remember to like, share, subscribe, like, share, subscribe, like, share, subscribe, and leave your comments. God bless you, and we will catch you on the other side. Yes, my viewers and subscribers, so the boat has landed. So don't look at that. That's what I'm talking about. Shake it up a little bit. Everything move nothing stick there. It's all nice. So um that's it. That's where we want it to be. So we will catch you on the other side. God bless you. Yes, my viewers and subscribers. So the boat has landed. We're about to eat. But before we do that, we um, Bless the food, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Once again, we thank you for your provision. Lord, we pray that you bless this food. Sanctify it, dear Lord, once again, that be nourishing to our bodies. We just give you thanks. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen. God bless you, my viewers and subscribers. We will catch you in our next video.